Hello, this is Helm4004. A brand new 1.18 experimental snapshot has been released again. This is at number 6. This does some more terrain changes and stuff like that. And hopefully soon, we will be able to start seeing full 1.18 snapshots with all of this stuff put in. But with all that, let's get started on what is new in this experimental snapshot. Starting out, the mountain placement has been tweaked again. Groves and snowy slopes are less likely to generate on mountain peaks. And in cold climates, groves and snowy slopes tend to start much lower down, while in temperate and hot climates, they tend to start up higher. Also, the never-ending battle of microbiomes is still going on. Hopefully, some temperature clashes in microbiomes have been reduced, and hopefully we will see less of these splotting up the world. In the last snapshot, the lush caves were accidentally changed to be a bit smaller. In this snapshot, they have reverted it, so hopefully we have nice and big sized lush caves once again. Some of the taiga types, like the giant taiga, and things like that are now considered not to be cold biomes anymore. This is just to make the biome placement more balanced. Rather, if they are cold biomes or not, this is just to make the world generation more balanced. Also, in some of the hill types, the springs have been reduced. This was they were a bit all over the place and spread out a lot, so you can still find them, but there are just fewer of them. Inside aquifers, there is now a magma blocks to have more air when you're diving underwater. Also in the oceans, going down into a deeper aquifer can can bring you into a water tunnel, which can then eventually pop out into another cave. Also, underwater ocean ravines are back. They're using a cave carvers, so they're not the same as before, but they are more natural looking. Horses, donkeys, and mules can now follow you using enchanted golden apples, golden apples, or golden carrots. This is so you can get them across water without having to ride them. Also, finally, the swamps can spawn in drier biomes. This is so that drier biomes aren't spawning in swamps. And that is everything in this snapshot. The article link is in the description below if you want to check out any of this for yourself. And to install this version, you have to go out and download it, put it and unzip it in your versions folder, and then create a new configuration in your launcher for that version. I hope this was helpful, and I hope you enjoyed. And for now, this is Helen4004 saying goodbye.